Kawa. Hi, Prendo. Do you know who a trade unionist is? Yes, Kim. A trade unionist is a person who demands better working conditions for workers. You're right, Pendo. They are a lot like you, since you don't like to see people suffer, and you're always quick to help those in need. Our teacher introduced us to some famous Kenya trade unionists. One was Tom Boyer, and the other one I learned about was Makan Singh. I was overjoyed when my dad said he'll be taking me to Nairobi to visit the Kenya National Archives and the Nairobi National Museum on Labor Day. You should come too, Pendo. It will be our chance to learn so much about our favorite subject, history. Labor Day is an important day that is celebrated by many people all over the world every year on May 1st. It is a day to appreciate the workers of our nation, especially trade unionists like Makan Singh. Hey Pendo, you made it! Yes, my dad was also interested in learning about the story of Makan Singh and he was told that this is one of the places to find it. Oh, that's great. We can learn more together, but I can tell you what I know about him too. After all our learning, we needed a break, and the ice cream shop nearby was perfect. Here, we shared all we knew about trade unionist Makan. We talked about the great work he had done in Kenya and India. Do you know that Makan Singh was just a young man when he started out in the fight for justice? Yes, Kim. He wanted workers to be paid fairly for their work and to be provided with medical care whenever they felt sick. He also wanted Kenya to gain independence from the British, and he was supported by workers all over the country who wanted the same thing as well. Do you know that Makan Singh was arrested by the colonial government because of what he believed in and spent 11 years in jail? That's a very long time. Yes, Kim, and he was arrested not only in Kenya, but also in India. People were not allowed to visit Makan in jail. Only his family members were, but they were allowed to see him for only a short time. Not even his lawyers. They even tried to bribe him to move to India and never come back, but he refused. There's something that I admire Makan for, Pendo. What is that, Kim? Did you hear that he was moved from Nairobi to Nyeri and even to Lokitaung? But he did not give up on fighting for our country. Kim, that is the spirit we should emulate as children who love and want to serve our country, as Makan did. And I see that a lot in you, Pendo. Maybe you'll be a great leader in the future. I believe all of us will be great leaders for our country. Bye, Pendo. Bye, friends. We are off to our next destination, the Kenya National Museum. It has been a well-spent Labor Day. Hello children, are you enjoying Hummingbird Tales? would love to hear from you. Ask your parents to send us feedback on SMS or WhatsApp on 0720-728-592 or on Paukwa Stories on social media. Pa kawa pa kawa pa kawa